Have you ever wondered if humans are really great apes? The answer might surprise you. Biologically, humans belong to the family hominidae, alongside chimpanzees, gorillas, and orangutans. We share 98 to 99% of our DNA with chimpanzees, have opposable thumbs, large brains, complex social behaviors, and extended parental care all traits of great apes. But here's the twist. For centuries, humans were not considered apes. Why? Cultural and religious beliefs placed humans in a separate, divine category. Early scientists avoided linking humans to animals, fearing it would challenge the idea that humans were uniquely created. Even Carl Linnaeus, in 1758, classified humans with primates. But faced criticism for suggesting humans were biologically similar to apes, it wasn't until Darwin's theory of evolution that the connection became clear. And the fossils began to reveal our story, around 3 to 4 million years ago, Australopithex afarensis, like the famous Lucy, walked upright in Africa, showing early bipedalism. About 2.4 to 1.4 million years ago, Homo habili, the handyman, used tools, had larger brains, and more human-like hands. Around 1.9 million years ago, Homo erectus spread out of Africa, used fire, and built shelters, bridging apes and modern humans. Finally, by 300,000 years ago, Homo sapiens appeared. They had large brains, and developed language and symbolic culture. Alongside fossils, genetic evidence confirmed our place. Humans are closer to chimpanzees than chimps are to gorillas. Today, science recognizes that humans are great apes, uniquely advanced in culture and cognition, yet still firmly part of the ape family tree. So actually evolutionary biology explains how humans aren't separate from nature, we're the great apes that walked upright and changed the world.